80% of users make use of mobile app instead of website. Now, if you have a website and um, your website is commercial and it requires enough users, so 80% of your users prefer using your mobile app than going to your website because they, they see your website as kind of like a stress. Instead, they prefer using the mobile app. So in this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how you can convert your website using web to APK Builder to transform your website to an Android app. Now you can build the Android APK and you can also build the Android app bundle. Now the good aspect of this is you can build it and upload it to your Google Play Store. So I'll be teaching you step by step on how to build it. And you know, in my next video, I'm going to teach you how you can create a key store and how you can upload it to your Play Store successfully. So if you know you are new to this channel, I want you to smash the subscribe button turn on the bell notification so that if I release next video, you will be the first person to see it. Without wasting our time, let's go straight to the business of the day. Now, I have already downloaded my software. Um, this is their official website. Um, if you want to purchase um, um, the, the files with them, then you could visit their official website and you know purchase the file with them. Then, if you want a discount, yeah, if you want a discount, then we have the file. I will, I will I just you know send us a message on whatsapp and we'll set the discount price for you then without wasting time let's go straight to the point now this is the software this is the software and this is how the environments look like this is the latest version version 5.0 this version 5.0 so you can as well play around um the environment here yeah, so i'll just teach you how you can convert your website to apk file so now if you have a local html website you just click on this local and you put it title and you are going to upload your file but if you have a url which it's what i'm going to use right now so you put the url of your website take for instance uh, i have my movie site um this um ninjatrend.org is a movie site so now the package name is what the package name is ninja trend ninja trend then this place you can still leave it as ninja trend then this place you can still leave it as ninja trend now the version of your mobile app is what is it version you know one or version two or version three so i'll just call my version 2.0 and i'll leave the rest here so um how do you want the app to be you know appearing is it portrait or landscape or auto rotate Maybe if you turn your mobile phone, then it will turn to landscape. So I'd prefer portrait. It should just be fixed on portrait. Now there is an icon. There is icon like your your like this very place I'm pointing. So you can choose your an icon. You could just go. So I'm just going to use a random um, image as an icon. So I'm just going to use this as an icon. Then I'll move over to. Um, about the dialogue so this place is what you write about your mobile app what is it about maybe um, is an um, is a movie website where you download any kind of movie and you are entertained this is that then um, Let's take for instance, someone want to share the app to another person. So what should be the message? Hi there, give this app a try. Yeah? Or I'll just say, um, if you need latest movies, then download this app. So I'll just leave it like that. Then maybe someone want to exit the app. What message should appear there? So you customize the message here. So now, um, if you don't want the app to show like your kind of browser view, then you can click on hide web view uh, UA. Or you can click on this hide Android or mobile UA or desktop mode so um, you can just use this you can just use this you don't need a desktop mode now custom page now this custom page now is where um, take for instance um, someone loads a page and um, there is no uh, that page does not exist so what should be an error page so you can upload your custom page and HTML file, or if you want to use the default, you use the default. So your URL, since we are using URL, so we are going to put um, ninjatrend.org. This is our URL. So this place will be ninjatrendmovies. 
the title so our url will be nigertrend.org so you can put the url of your website there so now do you want to enable add more monetization maybe you have a monitor um maybe google access for mobile phone and the rest like that for mobile for app so you can simply click on enable and you know you click enable banner and you set it but i'm just going to you know skip this now if you need push notification so this is where you put your uh, you put your push notification then you choose your icon and the rest so i'm just going to skip that for now then if you want um, conf um navigation so you want like um you want to create external menu yeah you want to create external menu so i could just call this maybe um action movies take for instance you want to create external menus then i'm going to put the url here I'm, I'm going to put action movies here so this is how you create external menus if you want to create as many external menus as you like so you just create it and you click on import and you apply so um from there you go to customization so you can customize the color of the title of your site so according to maybe your your website color so you can just choose and my website color i think is black so i'm just going to click on this apply now on this extra you can just play around there you can add whatever you want to add here and that is also um the default spin progress wheel anyone you want to choose if it is custom you can choose your custom or dotted anyone you want to do so once you are done the next thing is to click on build android apk and that is all so that is how you build your uh, mobile app using web to apk builder so the next thing is for you to click on this build android app and if you ask you to be patient for it to build then you click on okay so it's going to you know build everything for you and it's going to generate an apk file for you it's going to generate an apk file for you so once you are done you can simply click on this build app bundle which you you have to upload it to your play store so that is how you you know build a mobile app from scratch using web to apk builder so you don't need to write any code line or the rest it is it, it, going to convert your website to mobile app in a professional way and you can get it uploaded to play store like i said if you found value in this video please smash the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification so that you'll be first whenever we release videos like this so